Are we ready? <sighs> All right, let's do it, sis. Let's write a TV show. Woo! Okay, so when you write a TV show, do you start out with an outline or is that just for a short film? No, that makes sense. Right? right, so you know what you're gonna write about, the structure of it all, what's happening next. Yeah. What happened to all that funny stuff we came up with last week? Oh yeah, I put it in a Google Doc. Hold oh, on, let me find it. Smart. It's in one of these docs. My acting you teacher is it? always telling me to write stuff down in a Google list, you know, and I never do. Maybe that's why it's taking me so long to like get out of the stagnation I'm in. Sort of like Bambi did after his dad. Yeah, it's fine. I can't find it. It's fine. We're just gonna start from scratch. Start from scratch. I'm gonna Google how to write an outline and then you can come up with character names. Okay, for a character, we want something okay. bold, something okay. new, something fresh to say, you know, like Brooklyn, Brooklyn. I like Brooklyn or Romeo. For a girl, I like Harper. <gasps> the Beckhams. Okay, I found the script for Super Bad. I'm sure we can take something from this to get us on the right track. Brilliant. Did you know that Seth Rogen wrote this when he was 14? 14? I don't even think I knew what sex was at 14. At 14, I was peeing in the public water park. Sex. God. Okay, so he starts with a location. Yes. Right? Yeah. Okay. Interior apartment. It's about right. us. Yes. Right, that's where we're starting off. Great. Us. I love it. Day or night? On three. One, two, three. Day. Day. I knew it. Brilliant. We did it. Okay, interior apartment. Day. That sounds so official. This feels so good. We're writing comedy and sister. We're doing it. This is how Nicole Kidman must have felt when she won for Moulin Rouge. I'm 99% sure she didn't win an Oscar for Moulin Rouge. No, she definitely won for Moulin Rouge. No, I'm 100% sure she didn't win an Oscar for Moulin Rouge and you can Google it. Yeah, that was a big year for her and Keith. Google, Google it. Okay, so she didn't win for Moulin Rouge. Thank you, I know. But did you know she produced Big Little Lies? When does season two come out? I don't know. I oh. hope Shailene Winley's not in it. No offense. I'm gonna look it up. Oh my God. What? I think Beyonce hates Nicki Minaj. What? I think Beyonce hates Nicki Minaj. Well, I hear you. I just need to know why. Beyonce just brought out Remy Ma at her concert at the Rose Bowl. Who's Remy Ma? That's what No Frauds was about. What is no frauds? Uh -huh. Are you kidding me? No, I seriously don't. I have, no, oh, I have no idea what you're talking you, about. It's the biggest pop culture moment of 2017, no. Amanda. Oh, that is an insane statement. Oh, but it's a big statement. It's a true statement. It's a huge I don't need no frauds. Riley, if it was the biggest pop culture moment of 2017, yeah, I think it. I would have heard about it. Yeah. You've heard it. I've never she heard invented it. inches. No. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. You can even spell prog, and then she spun around. God, I don't know why, but every time we get together, I immediately want a sweet treat. Me f***ing too. It's like Pavlov's Law. Pavlov's Law. Are you familiar with Pavlov's Law? What's Pavlov's Law? Pavlov's Law. Pavlov's Law. Pavlov's Law. Law. Pavlov's Law. How is that different from what you're saying? Pavlov's Law. Pavlov's Law. We should get ice cream. We should get ice cream. Pavlov's Law. Pavlov's Law. I think we just Pavlov's Law ourselves. Pavlov's Law. Yeah, Pavlov's Law. Pavlov's law. Yeah. Pavlov's law. Pavlov's law. Pavlov's law. Pavlov's law.